Hey guys, welcome back. We are in the kitchen and I am with my good friend Roger Ouellette. We're going to make up some falafel inspired by our most recent trip to the Clover food truck. You didn't invite me. You didn't ask. All right, well then let's, let's just make this. Yeah, you that's stay a good on, idea. You stay on your side of the table. I will, I will be here. Okay, I see how it is. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. May the best chef win. <laughs> let's get started. We got our chickpeas, we got our onions, we got our garlic. You gonna make some hummus for me? I'm gonna make some hummus. All right. It's a good, it's a good dish on its own, but with falafel, amazing. Even better. I'm gonna start with the falafel here. So I'm gonna cut up some of these, uh, these onions and garlic. Uh, while you're doing that, I am gonna, I'm gonna put some of these chickpeas in the, in the food processor. Oh boy. And uh, this, this requires uh, lemons, but we don't have that. So when, when College Kitchen doesn't give you lemons, you. Uh, you can't, don't use them. You can't make lemonade or anything, really. <laughs> That's all right. You know, those chickpeas were soaked overnight because it makes it easier for them to blend. Uh, if you don't want to take the time out to soak them, you could just boil them, and uh, they'll soften up for you. I'm, I'm going to put some uh, uh, oregano ooh, in ooh. with the hummus. Hey, here. you want to just, just put a, a uh, just a pinch? Just a, just I mean, a... I need a catchphrase like kazam but that kazam was a, that was a terrible child kazam yeah that was Jack, was that so. when you wanted to to become a magician when you grew up I, you told me all about that <laughs> i never said that yeah you did i told you that in confidence so i need you to stop cutting those for a second what do you and need me for? I, I need you to mash some garlic for me well i mean i can make that happen for you hummus is actually uh my family's world famous for making hummus is it yeah all right well i need to add tahini paste quick Quick quiz for you, uh, kitchen yeah, man. Sure. How many uh, <laughs> tablespoons are in a teaspoon? How many what? Or how many it's gonna be teaspoons too late are there? To even answer that question because you already poured them in. There. <laughs> no, no, but really, how many? How many teaspoons are in a tablespoon? Uh, I think like eight. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Old rule of thumb. I'm gonna. Uh, I'm just gonna guesstimate two. <laughs> yeah, but I'm totally telling you, it's eight. No, this is an old family secret. I, oh, I know oh, how too. this goes. I know how this yeah. goes. Yeah, you're a pro. I, I am. That's why we had you on the show. I know. Right now. Well, I'm just gonna gently toss this in there. Okay. And uh, I need I need a pinch of, pinch of parsley. Just here. a scooch of parsley. Yeah. I don't like that word. I love so. that word. It's epic. Okay. okay. Now, doesn't that look just? I mean, you could eat that right now, right out of no. the food process. No, no, I couldn't actually. <laughs> But it looks great. It's just not my kind of thing. What are you doing over there? Uh, well, basically, I'm finishing up a little bit of my yeah? onion. Yeah. Is that what you're doing? Yeah. Okay. Good. Yeah. And what I'm going to do hold after? On, hold on. Oh, no. Go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead. Well, basically, <laughs> you're a funny guy. It's pretty loud. Um, but I'm going to throw some parsley in here. Um, just to give it that flavor. I'm going to throw in some cumin, some ground cumin, just a. Uh, that's good. Just a scooch. Yeah. We're ready to make some falafel. I got everything I need in my handy dandy measuring cup. Well, I just finished making my hummus. So uh, mm -hmm. a great way to garnish that, olives. Olives, I'm going to cut course. up some olives. Sure, if, sure. If Hop wanna, over here. Hop if over you just want to scooch over there. Oh, <laughs> right? you, you. You're such a funny guy. So we need about a half pound here. I'm just going to toss that in there. While you do that, huh? I yeah. am going to heat up some oil. Okay, so we have everything we need in our bowl, and it's time to make some falafel balls. Yeah. Uh, we're going we're gonna to scoop out just about a teaspoon. If you want to grab that okay. for me. Right. Yeah, this yeah, is a little just... hands-on. This is uh, a little yeah. hands-on. And the balls need to be, like, gently rolled, but they also <laughs> need to be firm at the same time. We gotta make a few more. I think more. mine was a little better. Yeah. Oh, whoa, really? I think my ball's bigger. <laughs> well. Roger, if you would like to do the honors, yeah, I and would. potentially take the brunt of the burn. Uh, I don't trust you, so oh, yeah, let's. I'll, great. I'll take care of this. Great. Just uh, let right. it gently fall. 
Well done, well done. Okay, back Ooh, up. I'm gonna back up from yeah, that. Yeah, I would wow. too. This is gonna cook quick, but the nice thing is you add a couple more balls to it. The temperature difference will cool down the oil. It won't be so dangerous to stand next to you. If you yeah, want me to... I'm gonna let you. All right, do all right. The I'll next take. Couple. I'll take. I'll take the next couple. The next six or so seven. So I'm gonna reshape these just a little bit. Um, I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little scared too. So I'm gonna turn this down. And uh, there we go. So we got two balls in there. So we are good to go. Our balls are nice and crispy after what I would consider to be somewhat of a life-threatening situation. Wouldn't you agree? Yeah. Yeah. A but, bit your fault. But, but I think it's time fine. to go put our balls in some pockets. Come on, let's do this. <laughs> I'm going to throw in some hummus first. What do you think, Roger? Uh, good, good plan. Good plan. Okay. I'm actually going to change it up. I'm going to throw in some lettuce first. Oh, wow. Look at mine. you. Trendsetter. Yeah. That's good. <laughs> That's good, Matt. We did a good job. I think the hummus really is, is what does it for me. You know, it's not a kick. I'm telling you. Mm. And the way the lettuce just crunches in your mouth, it's really good. You know, it was a lot of fun having you on set today. I got a lot of fun. I gotta, I, gotta, I gotta admit, thank you a lot for coming out and uh. Risking life and limb to, to fry some some falafel with me. I appreciate that. Uh, and thank you guys for coming out with us to the Clover food truck and then coming back with us to the kitchen to watch me and Roger do our thing. Uh, I mean, I'm still a little upset that I wasn't invited, but that's fine. I mean, at least you got to learn how to make falafel with me. I mean, that's a little bit better, don't you think? I guess so. I yeah. Guess so. He's happy. I'm happy. We're all happy. Thank you for joining us on College Kitchen. See you next time. Face, mm -hmm. bum, 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 b